Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier. So today in my this particular video, I am going to discuss one very interesting technique to remove salt and paper noise from image. Okay, one of the very interesting concept with respect to digital image processing. And if you have some fundamental background of machine learning and data science, then you can find certain similarity in between this particular noise removal technique and machine learning. Okay. So the technique is outlier method for noise removal. What is outlier? I have discussed in detail in my machine learning playlist. This outlier is that particular data point which is significantly different uh, compared to its neighbors, right? Like for example, I am having a vector. Okay, suppose maybe 41 is the first element, then 45 is the second element, then maybe 39 is the third element, then maybe uh, 2054 is the next element and another element is maybe you can consider as 40 okay so if you are observing this particular sequence you can clearly say that this particular fourth element is significantly different from rest of the uh, data points which are neighbor to this particular one right that's why we will consider this particular point as outlier okay so this is positive outlier because this is significantly higher than the rest of the values similarly negative side also outlier uh, can exist like for example uh, here another element is there which is 2 so this particular element is significantly smaller than the rest of the uh, data points right so this particular data point will consider as a negative outlier and i have discussed several techniques how to handle outliers apart from simply removing this right so same kind of uh, thing we are going to apply in noise removal scenario let us try to understand where we can use this first okay so suppose i am having one image which is rise.png image present in matlab database itself you don't need to take from external world okay if you have matlab you can simply call this particular image using rise.png im read function that's it right now let's corrupt our this particular original image using salt and paper noise so what is salt and paper noise salt and paper noise is nothing but that particular noise where some pixel values we will simply replace by 255 that will appear very bright kind of salt and some pixel values will be replaced by zero that means completely dark or black color those will be considered as uh, paper okay so if you call up this particular image by salt and paper noise it uh, can be uh, appeared like this okay you can understand easily that here some pixels are very bright which is salt and some pixels are very much dark or black color those are basically papers so it is appearing that we have basically sprinkled uh, some amount of salt and paper on this original image to get this particular image that's why this noise name is salt and paper noise right and in matlab if you want to implement this same uh, uh, function same parameter you have to pass that is salt and paper via the function im noise okay i'll be showing you that again already i have discussed while discussing median filter but again i will discuss no issue. So now, what is the technique we use to remove the salt and paper noise from the uh, from this corrupted image? We basically go with median filter instead of mean filter because mean is highly affected by this salt and paper values because these are highly extrema. So uh, in, to avoid that, we go with median value, right? And we apply median filter, and we have seen that we get a very good result with median filter. But there is a problem with median filter. What is that? If you consider the minimum window to apply median filter on this corrupted image, that should be at least 3 cross 3. So in 3 cross 3 window, there should be at least 9 elements, right? So each time to get a value in the filtered output, you have to sort those 9 pixel values, okay? And this is a very expensive operation. So basically you have to apply 9 element sorting in whole image. Okay, because the window will keep on sliding, right? So this median filter technique to remove salt and paper noise is a very expensive operation. And that's why we are coming up with another technique to remove salt and paper noise. Because mean filter we cannot directly use and median filter is expensive. So we need some other technique, right? That's what I am going to discuss, okay? So let's try to understand that. Applying the median filter can in general be a very slow operation because each pixel required the sorting of at least nine values. I hope it is quite clear. Okay. So instead of going with median filter, what we can do? 
to overcome this difficulty let's treat the noise pixels as outliers and how we handle outlier in machine learning or data science same kind of thing we'll try to apply to remove noise from noisy image to restore our original image okay so what is that pixel with whose gray value are significantly different from those of their neighbors those will be considered as outliers that means those are noise right so noise and outliers are same in this particular approach what i am going to discuss so what are these steps let's see so steps will be number 1 choose a threshold value okay so threshold value d this threshold value uh, you have to choose very wisely if you choose very small it will be a problem if you choose very large it will be another problem okay so depending on the context depending on the amount of noise present in your image okay you have to choose the threshold value very wisely now what we will do so suppose i am having my original image which is uh, corrupted by salt and pepper noise that is this one this is noisy image okay for a given pixel compare its value p where p is basically original uh, pixel value for that noisy image okay with the mean m of its value uh, of the value of its eight neighbor okay what is that so suppose i am having i am considering a three cross three window okay right like this what this particular line is suggesting suppose i am having the pixel values a b c d e f g h i okay so what we'll do compare the pixel always we consider central pixel value for comparison right so e is the basically pixel value from this noisy image this one we will compare with this eight neighbors a b c f i a g d okay that mean okay so e we have to compare with a plus b plus c plus f plus i plus h plus g plus d by h okay so this this, this is mean of uh, that uh, eight neighbors right and this is our original pixel we will compare this and what we are saying that if the absolute difference in between e and the average of eight neighbors is exceeding this particular threshold that time we will consider e as outlier okay and if that is outlier what we will do we will replace e by average of eight neighbors and if the absolute difference between original pixel and average of eight neighbors are not exceeding this particular threshold then we will understand okay e is basically normal pixel we will keep as it is okay so uh, again i am reading these steps choose a threshold value d for a given pixel compare its value p here e means p okay so original pixel value p with the mean m so this particular one is completely represented by the variable m okay and this e is basically p okay we will compare p and m okay where m is representing the value average value or mean value of eight neighbors okay if p minus m greater than d that is this particular value and this average value difference absolute difference is greater than the threshold we will consider that as outlier or noisy pixel okay otherwise they are not noisy pixel okay if the pixel is noisy we will replace the noisy pixel or outlier by average of its eight neighbor else we will keep it unchanged that's it that is how we treat outlier the same way we are going to uh, uh, remove noise that is salt and pepper noise from image okay now the whole concept will be very clear once i will show you the coding in matlab so let me go to matlab and show you okay so step 1 clc clear all close all warning off as you generally write nothing new right okay here then i can the warning off okay now here x equal to i am read lies dot png okay i am reading the image figure i am show x let's see the image first okay so this is the image you can give the title also input image okay now what we can do 
we will collect our this particular image with salt and paper noise okay so es equal to to collect the original image with noise i will use the function im noise okay im noise then first parameter will be our original image that is x then comma what will be the noise type we want to add salt and paper right so salt and paper see I, I have written partially but MATLAB is suggesting so I have to just press tab to make it complete that's it okay then how much amount do you want to give that we can control maybe 0 0.01 I am giving okay right and then here I can write figure I am show ES it can be the title as noisy image okay let's do a situation so here we are generating our noise image okay then what we will do then we need to so this is our noise image okay then what is the next step if you go to uh, the ppt what i told you i need to compare each pixel with average of its eight neighbor so i need to compute the average of eight neighbors right so what we can do simple so we want to explode only this one and uh, want to compute average of this. What is the mean filter? I have taught you. So mean filter is one one one, one one one, one one one, and then what we do? We divide by this particular one by nine. Okay, that is basically our mean filter. Now when we consider mean filter, that time the each output will be A B C plus D E F plus G H I by nine. But here we want to exclude the central pixel, so we will replace it as zero. And there are total how much uh, pixels remaining? Eight pixel, right? So for eight pixel average, I will divide by eight. That's it. So this will be our kernel, right? So let me go to MATLAB, and then here let me put the kernel. So mass equal to one one one. Then next row will be one zero one. Next will be one one one. Okay. Then divide by eight. Okay. That's it. Mass is created. Then Filt equal to what we will do? I will apply filter. I am filter uh, or original image is what? Uh, sorry, noisy image is yes. So noisy image we have to apply mask, right? So noisy uh, along with noisy image we have applied mask. Okay, right? Now what we will do? Here I am putting another figure. Now I will compute difference. Okay, so difference equal to absolute part of our noisy image yes minus of the filtered one sorry here i let me write here filt f i l t okay absolute difference we have taken and then uh, what we have to do here we need to uh, like here we are taking the difference absolute difference but we need to compare with a threshold so i am choosing a threshold that if the absolute difference is greater than 0 0.2 that time we will consider that those uh, pixels as noisy pixels because those will be significantly different from average of its neighbor and that time we will replace those pixels by the average value else we will keep it as it is okay so recovered image equal to basically so so this particular diff will be taking value 1 if they are noisy pixels okay so for noisy pixels also what we'll do we'll replace with the average value of 8 neighbors right average value of 8 neighbors is stored in this particular field variable so diff dot star field okay right and here as we are doing some arithmetic operation let me do here i am to double Okay, I can show. Uh, so let me show you the difference image also. I am show this, and then here again another figure I can take. So here uh, there is deep value is taking one which are noisy pixel. Uh, if it is noisy pixel, we will we are multiplying with the uh, eight neighbors average. That means we want to put the eight neighbor average value in place of noisy pixel. Else, if that is not a uh, noisy pixel. So how to understand which are not noisy pixel? So D value is taking zero for non-noisy pixel, right? So plus one minus one minus D because this is storing non-noisy pixel. Here for non-noisy pixel we want to put as it is value. So as it is value is stored what? As it is value is stored basically in our uh, 
yes okay so those are not noisy pixels okay so what i am doing here i am show recovered image so basically first i have read the image i added salt and pepper noise then i am filtering to get the average of eight neighbors then i am comparing one particular pixel with average of eight neighbors and checking whether they are exceeding threshold or not if they are exceeding threshold that time that means those are noisy pixel we are replacing with eight neighbors if they are non noisy pixel we are keeping as it is okay that is yes okay and the cover image so here let me give the title so diff is basically storing noisy parts noisy locations on the so noisy locations and here this one is title will be recovered image okay let's run this seems good let us check whether we are getting proper result so this is our input image correct this is our noisy image okay so here some let me see why it's not completing error using minus so here i i am getting error okay i got it what is happening so basically here this is i am to double uh, so field is basically double es is unsigned integer 8 bit right so let me do one thing instead of replacing here i am to double i can remove the brackets from here and let me convert here itself i think that will resolve our issue let us check so this is what this one is our input image this one is what this one is noisy image okay this one is what noisy location see if you consider noisy image how beautiful it has uh, taken all the noisy location including including salt and paper also then the next one is recovered image why recovered image is looking like this so diff dot star field okay one minus yeah i have got the result here i forgot to give dot star okay so what is happening this is our input image then we added salt and paper noise this particular third figure window containing identification of a uh, salt and paper noise okay and then if that is a uh, salt and paper noise we are replacing with the average of eight neighbors else we are keeping as it is see how beautifully we are getting the recovered image okay so this particular technique of noise removal is nothing but how we handle outlier right so that's why it is called outlier technique for noise removal okay and this is nothing but to overcome the disadvantage of the performance issue related to median filter because if we want to apply median filter at least nine elements we have to sort for each window and the window will keep on sliding the image is bigger it will take larger time that's why this is a bypass way which is quite efficient too only thing is that you need to set the threshold value very properly if you choose very high threshold value what will happen if you choose very high threshold value that time uh, the noisy pixels will also be considered as normal pixel and if you choose very low threshold value then there is a possibility that normal pixels also can be considered as noisy pixels okay so this uh, like uh, you have to choose this particular value properly to avoid this trade off that's it so i hope you have enjoyed this particular video i'll be providing the code in the description box or in the comment section if you want you can go through that and if you find this video helpful please like share and comment subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed till now and don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of my latest videos thank you